Hello, my name is Jonas Galvez. I'm a principal engineer working on open source at NodeSource. The title of my talk is Rethinking the Full Stack Framework. And I'll begin by posing a question. What do JavaScript full stack frameworks have in common? Let's start with the basics. You start with a Node.js web server, typically Express, then a modern JavaScript bundler, typically SWC or ESBoot. You connect the two so you can deliver production bundles and also development bundles with hot reload and SSR. So far, so good, but it's not quite there yet. A full stack framework needs to be able to provide client resources, the front end, and server resources, the back end APIs that can power an application. Convention over configuration helps with this. We can make it so every component under the pages folder becomes an HTML route and every script under the API folder becomes an API endpoint. Sound familiar? And then we need a CLI to expose all functionality. Most frameworks have a dev command, a build command, a start command, or something similar. What do JavaScript full stack frameworks have in common? I ask again. They are black boxes. The architecture ends up being framework first. The framework controls the server and everything else. The result is excellent developer experience, for sure, but the problem arises when you need to extract the best performance possible from your application. Most full-stack frameworks pack so many features that it becomes hard to keep track of everything going under the hood. What do you really need? What could be stripped off? How can you make your setup lighter? That's why I decided to go server first with Festify. Its architecture and plugin system are the cleanest and most transparent I have ever seen. Festify is a truly composable framework. You can start small, grow as you need. And that's what I'm trying to accomplish with Festify DX. Festify DX is Festify plus front-end goodness, all powered by Vita, of course. So you just have your server.js file, your Festify server, the Festify Vit plugin, and the Festify DX adapter for your framework of choice. In this snippet, I'm using solid.js. That's all you need. You start your Festify server, register Festify Vit, wait for Vit to be ready, in which case uh, it's harmless running in production. Uh, this only affects development mode and you have a single server.js file controlling your application and everything a full stack framework uh, would offer. Festify DX brings two titans together, Festify and Vit. You have flexible routing, integrated data fetching, hydration, and an universal store, hot reload, everything you would expect from a full stack framework. Without compromising performance, without compromising developer experience. The public beta is coming on October 20. Follow the project on GitHub to hear all about it. And also you'll find a link to a newsletter there. Thank you so much.